Welcome back everyone. Now I know it's meant to be Mystery Box Monday, it is the first Monday of the month, but I've been a little too unwell to film that video, just in case we hit something massive, a vintage pack, something like that. I can't get too excited, it sets off the cough, and then I'm coughing for hours. So today we're just going to rip into a Twilight Masquerade ETB. I haven't opened one of these just yet, and I'm pretty excited to see the promo card, and uh, you know, hopefully we get some nice hits out of it. So let's waste no more time, dive on down, and take a look. All right, ladies and gentlemen, here we have it, and it kind of just fits on the screen, but you get an idea. We've all seen ETBs before. We'll take a quick look at the back. We've got our packs, all the rest of the stuff that we're used to. Those dice actually look really, really nice. We've got our promo card. So uh, as always, I'm going to fast forward through opening this up. We'll get everything laid out so we can take a look at it and see what's inside these ETBs. Let's go. All right, well, there we have it. Everything laid out, ready to go. And uh, yeah, those dice are actually pretty nice. Uh, you got a nice blue sparkle. I do like a bit of blue. So we'll sit that off to the top. We've got these, which we've all seen these before. We've got our dividers, which pretty cool. I do like the color combination they've used on these. So that's, that's all right. We've got our a brick of energies as always. Oh, there is our promo. Okay, so the Teal Mask Ogapon promo card. It is a Black Star promo. Come on, camera. There we go. So, number 123. So, that will definitely be going in the binder. We may as well. No, we'll leave it in there for now. I'll take it out when I put it in the binder, but we will sit it up top. We've got our code card for everyone playing along at home. We've got our sleeves, which are actually really, really nice. I do like them. I just don't use them because they tend to warp the card a little bit. Um, we've got our packs, so we should have nine, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine packs indeed. And then we've got our little book, our player's guide, which has a full list of all the cards in there. Um, so yeah, if you want to grab yourself one of these, you can take a closer look at all of the big hits. But uh, yeah, there's, there's a few of them. And uh, there are a lot of cards that we do not have for this set. I still haven't done a binder build video. I was meant, I was planning on doing that actually last Friday, but uh, yeah, ended up rather ill. So the the man flu got me, and uh, it was not a pleasant one. But uh, yeah, we got nine packs to get into, guys. My throat and my voice is still a bit funny, so bear with me throughout this. But uh, nine packs of Twilight Masquerade. Let's get into it. See if we can't get some of the big hits today. All right, eventually we will get to doing a binder video, uh, maybe this Friday, maybe the Friday after. Not sure at the moment, um, but yeah, we'll get to it. We'll see how far off we are from completing the set, but I think we're quite a way off, guys. <laughs> I honestly think there are so many SIRs, SRs, uh, art rares, all that sort of thing, illustration rares, or illustration rares, I should say, um, that we're missing. So yeah, hopefully we can get at least one or two out of this box. From what I've been told, these boxes, they've been pretty good so far to people. So yeah, hopefully we can get at least a couple of nice hits out of the nine packs. And then as I, as I mentioned guys, Mystery Box Monday has been postponed till next Monday. So uh, keep an eye out for that one though. It, it should be a lot of fun. They always are. I love Mystery Box Monday. Um, I love the gamble side of it. And uh, you know, if we can strike vintage or something like that, who, who knows? It would be absolutely amazing. All right, we've got Flabebe, Tetsugiri, a Frigoraf, a Jamming Tower. Oh, yeah, let's go. Leafeon, gorgeous Leafeon card, that one. we got a Torkoal. Oh, and a Lucian Full Art Trainer card. Let's go. We're on the board with a Full Art. Not bad at all. Pretty interesting looking card. Not bad. Not bad as our first hit. Let's keep on going. Pack number three. Okay. Here's a code card for everyone playing along at home. Let's go. Alrighty, we got a Water Energy, a Litwick, a Poochiena, Palisan, Timber, Glaceon. We got a Diplin going into Kilowattral, a Festival Grounds, a Florgeous, and a Half Hit. We've got the HGH Dolphin, Palafin EX. Alrighty, not bad, not bad. Okay. 
Now guys, also, uh, this month is going to be my two year anniversary on YouTube. On the 18th of July, two years ago, I put out my first ever video. Uh, so pretty excited. We're gonna have a live stream coming up for that guys to celebrate two years on YouTube. Um, so yeah, make sure you tune in for that live stream. It's gonna be absolutely awesome. You guys know, if you've been around the channel long enough, what to expect for the live streams when we're celebrating uh, mystery boxes. So I've got a heap of them lined up already. Got in nice and early for that. Why is the camera focusing on Lucian? Let's have to move him out of the picture a little bit. But uh, yeah, the, the upcoming celebration is going to be absolutely massive. Lots of fun stuff to open up. Uh, maybe even a few giveaways. So yeah, stay tuned for that, guys. It's going to be a lot of fun. All right, we're finishing that pack with a Sinist Char. That name always gets me. <clears throat> it's not a it's not an easy name to roll off the tongue, that's for sure. All right, next pack. Oh, we got one and a half hits. We got to do a bit better than that. We got a lightning on this one. Nope, we have a leaf energy. Darumaka, Corfish, Grookey going into Helioptile. We got a Leafion going into Swanna, Glamora, a Tetsugiri, Slurpuff, and a Chandelure Holographic. Okay, okay. Someone told me these were good. So far, they're, they're okay. They're okay. <coughs> Alrighty. There's another code card. We're going to go with fire on this one. Come on. Nope, it is a dark energy. We got Finizen, Caretaker, a Glimit, Lampant, going into a Snorlax. Love a good Snorlax card. More Petko. Come on. We got Poltergeist, Poltergeist, Slugma, and another half hit. We do have a Terraform, though. The, what is it? A Hearth Flame Mask. Ogapon. Hearth Flame Mask Ogapon. Okay. Sure, whatever. <laughs> whatever you guys say. Alright, we'll sleeve on it up. Put it up top. Another half hit. Alright, three packs remaining, guys. Well, let's get into them. We need something more than half hits here, though. We want to see an SR, SIR, whatever they call it. The big hits. Let's go. We got a Water Energy. Litwick, did I see something peeking or is it just a regular holographic? Who knows? It always catches me off guard a little bit. We got Timber, Ambipom, Bug Catching Set. Oh, we are skipping Agron. Sorry, mate. We got Boomerang Energy, Seeking. Come on, give us something. Nope, it was just a holographic Inferno. Okay. Well, not a lot going on, guys. Not a lot going on. We got two packs remaining. Let's go. Alrighty, come on. Hopefully you guys are using these code cards. If you are, let me know. Let me know if you're getting something good from them. We got a Dark Energy, Aaron, Spinarak, a Sandshrew, going into Darumaka, Clefable, Cook. Come on, grab the cards. We got Palafin, Whirlipede, Leron, and a Greninja <laughs> EX. Okay, okay, another half hit, but a Greninja EX Terraform. At least I can pronounce that one. All right, we'll sleeve him on up uh, and put him up top. Alrighty. Guys, it is our last pack, so you know what that means. Hit that thumbs up, send over some last pack magic, because we kind of really need it. We've had a full art and then three half hits. Surely, last pack magic is a thing. We need something big. Can we get it? Here's a code card. We've got one in the front. We're going to go with Psychic, and it is a Steel Energy. We've got Apom, Applin, Swellix going into Litwick. We got Tatsugiri, Diplin, Jamming Tower. Oh, there we go. We got an A spec. We got a secret box. Okay. All right. We'll take it. We got a Torco. And we are ending today's video on another one of these guys that does not roll off the tongue. Well, ladies and gentlemen, there we have it. I know those ETBs have been out for a little while, but I just haven't got around to opening them. And uh, it wasn't terrible. We had a full art trainer, we got an ace bet card, and uh, a couple of half hits as well. So I've definitely had worse ETBs, but I've also had better ones too. So yeah, they, they're not they're not terrible, I must say. But that's it for this video, guys. If you did like what you watched, hit that thumbs up. It really does help the channel. If you want to see more content like this, click on one of these two videos. If you're new, don't be shy, hit subscribe, and we'll catch you on the next one.
Bye for now.